Senior Superintendent Daniel Arzu's candidacy in the village council election for Georgetown has come under scrutiny. Arzu is vying to become the next chairman of that community. But as a career police officer, there is the question of whether or not Arzu can lawfully participate in the election as a candidate. Section 61 of the Public Service Regulations clearly outlines what elections public officers are prohibited from actively participating in. The Public Service Regulations um, deals with the established officers and it's very clear in Section 61 of the regulations, it speaks about public officers being able to participate in, or not being able, sorry, to participate in certain elections. Uh, mainly elections that fall under the representation of the People's Act, uh, elections that fall under the municipal um, different acts, the Town Council's Act, Police City Council Act, and the Belmopan City Council Act. It does not specify Village Council Act. So how that has, has been interpreted is that they can participate as candidates in a Village Council election. And so, in accordance with that section of the Public Service Regulations, Public officers are not prohibited from taking part in village council elections. A subsequent section, however, does make a distinction pertaining to active participation in matters that are of a party political nature. However, under 62, it lists other uh, regulations that govern public officers in reference to party politics. And it's very specific, especially 62I, subsection I, that public officers cannot participate or engage in party political matters. So mm -hmm. there are two very clear uh, regulations there. So to answer your question whether they can participate as a candidate in a village council election, yes, they can, uh, because village councils are, uh, by their very nature, they should be neutral, no? But whether they are going to be participating in party political matters, then that is specifically restricted under 62. Arzu's participation in the village council election for Georgetown is therefore permitted, according to Minister Henry Charles Usher's interpretation of the regulations. That is because Arzu is running as an independent candidate. So then if a public officer, an established public officer, wants to um, participate in any election, a village council election, they would have to do so as an independent candidate. Correct. They are not forbidden from participating as candidates um, because the, the, the general nature of the village council is that they are neutral. But when they start to engage in party political matters, then that is specifically forbidden under the, the second section, or 62. And on Monday, Commissioner of Police Chester Williams told reporters that Senior Superintendent Arzu is proceeding with pre-retirement leave and will be out of the police department by the time the village council election is held. Kompo Williams also argued that Arzu is not aligned with any political party. Mr. Arzu is proceeding on pre-retirement leave very shortly. For the most part, if he were to be elected the chairman of Judge Stone, he would not be a police officer. He would be out by then. That's one. Two, he is not aligned with any political party. He is running as an independent in the village of Georgetown. So there is a clear distinction there when it comes to both individuals. So I, I, I can't see how we can compare the two at all. Reporting for News 5, I am Paul Lopez.